Hi, I'm Alex Bizu with quick tips on how to write a good essay, a passing essay on criminal law for the Washington State Bar exam. When you go to the call of the question there and you see what felonies parties can be charged with, right there you see it's the criminal law horse race essay with 15 to 18 issues, sometimes like 19 issues I saw once. So you have to be very quick very precise you know don't waste your space don't waste your time on that essay it's just like an int intentional towards essay uh, so if there are two people there uh, you know bob and andy and they're in the bar discussing let's rob a next door jewelry store aha uh -huh, so you have your inchoate offenses you have um, anticipatory offenses uh, complicity um, uh, i mean uh, conspiracy attempt solicitation if uh, complicity, if, if, they, if they go there together, you discuss complicity if it's there. Uh, accessory before the fact, after the fact, uh, do that. And no Pinkerton, Pinkerton rule is adopted in Washington, remember that. After that, you jump into the substantive crimes. I remember them by the mnemonic homicidal breakfast on drugs. So homicide, burglary, robbery, extortion, assault, kidnapping, forgery, arson, sex, crimes, drugs, uh, theft uh, offenses and uh, you know sex crimes I have never seen tested you know on those practice essays that they give you uh, the Washington bar examiners uh, but I, I studied them and it was not tested on my bar exam probably it will not be tested but study uh, them anyway now they will give you extra points for smaller crimes and watch out for these smaller crimes that are not like in the, in the general review course and these smaller crimes are vehicle crimes you know um, drive-by shooting for example criminal trespass in burglary it's just being on the on the premises unlawfully remaining or entering the premises without an intent to commit a crime there um, uh, and uh, resisting an, uh, an arrest or reckless endangerment that would be an assault situation unlawful imprisonment it's another crime and don't confuse it with the false imprisonment tort so unlawful imprisonment is a crime address it you will collect that half a th third of a point harassment making unlawful threats it's a crime um, now in sex crimes you may see like exploitation you know molestation or sexual misconduct with a minor or a prisoner motor vehicle um, ass assault or mo motor vehicle uh, theft and the gun theft remember is always a second degree crime uh, possession of a firearm that's also can be a minor crime now when you're done with crimes address defenses I address them as they appear so if Bob was intoxicated in that bar so it's the intoxication defense right there involuntary sex intoxication um, uh, is a defense but not voluntary one insanity duress necessity are most commonly tested in addition to intoxication I advise you to do at least 10 essays on criminal law I did a little bit less eight uh, essays uh, to be good you know to gain confidence uh, when you study and of course do between one and 100 essays on uh, on all subject areas and about 50 essays on ethics um, study my outline listen my quick reviews in the beginning uh, listen my lectures this is all for free available on my website uh, and um, when you're done in your last week like uh, last day study with quick reviews and uh, write um, those essays and you will be okay. I wish you all the best on your bar exam. Be successful in everything you do. Thank you for your time. Bye-bye.